The last few weeks are a point in our country's history not seen since the Civil War. We would think any sane person would want peace, security, harmony, and tranquility. If everyone lived by truth, fairness, sustainability, and integrity, the world would have exactly that, but we don't. The concerning part is there are many working towards the exact opposite outcome. Political correctness rationalizes this as a matter of perspective and blames us for failing to recognize the different ways to achieve harmony. But I'm afraid this is pure evil at work. Apathy is the enemy of truth. Anyone who says there's nothing we can do is part of the problem. The feeling of hopelessness when national news and social media tells us things that make no rational sense is exactly how they want us to feel. The fact they censor content, shut down accounts, and drop service providers that disagrees with the deep state are actions found only in countries like North Korea. They want everyone to stop questioning what they are doing and do not allow any reporting of this corruption of our constitution. They want businesses to go broken or become dependent upon the government for survival. They want us to think our president is evil, and they are good, trying to protect us from him. This is how the road to hell is paved. This is all part of the New World Order, where the populations are controlled, gradually taking away any ability to communicate freely or be self-sufficient or able to control our own destiny. A government of, by, and for the people is an obstacle for the deep state. Their oxygen is our money used to grab more power. Their selfish agenda uses the economy, the environment, the pandemic, and social unrest to have us voluntarily give them more power out of fear and not logic. The deep state gives us rules that don't apply to them. This happens in godless societies where technology controlled by the deep state makes truth subjective, with no consideration for future consequences. Socialism and communism needs to eliminate any recognition of God and uses this pandemic to stop the people from going to church. They want people to believe that government can solve our problems and everything good will come from the government if we cooperate. The deep state is deathly afraid of Donald Trump and what he knows, with censorship the only way to control him. This explains the irrational behavior of Pelosi and the deep state who are acting like criminals trying to escape execution. They do not, they will do anything to distract us from seeing their crimes and stop Trump from exposing this evidence from WikiLeaks showing their corruption and treasonous behavior. These are times that try men's souls and no longer just a matter of perspective. Trump and this country's patriots will get to the bottom of this. This is Keith Kuby praying that all of you really do want to make this world a better place.